The platypus is a rare but well-known animal. However, when in 1797 the skin of a platypus was first brought to England from Australia, it was classed as an amphibious animal from the genus of moles. English scientists thought this was a taxidermy hoax and looked for seams to prove that it was a fake. Only weeks later did they believe that such a waterfowl mammal really existed. Do you think that all discoveries about the animal kingdom have already been made? Well, just look at these natural mutations. We've compiled the top 10 most shocking anomalies in animals. Let's go. In the tales of many peoples, there are legends of snakes with several heads. Even in Game of Thrones, there was a three-headed dragon on the emblem of the Targaryens. Such reptiles really do exist. No, we're not talking about dragons, but snakes with three heads. The cobra, which rises from the ground and spreads its hood, looks impressive. But it's not its appearance that's scary, but its venom, which can kill even an elephant. How scared would you be, though, of a cobra with three times as much venom and three times as many sharp teeth because it has three heads? In India, three-headed cobras have been reported from time to time. Some of them are refuted as pranks or simply photoshopped. But in fact, scientists say that it's highly likely that such snakes exist, and that no one has survived meeting one. You can't say the same for two-headed snakes. Fortunately, or vice versa, such snakes have already fallen into the hands of scientists, who have even managed to find out something about their structure. For example, in Virginia, a two-headed copperhead was discovered with biologists having studied the snake. At only about 6 inches, or 15 centimeters, this snake's a sweet little baby snake, right? Perhaps, but copperhead snakes are relatives of vipers. Apparently, this specimen ate mainly insects, but actually wasn't especially well suited to survive in the wild. Yes, it had twice as much venom as an ordinary snake, but both heads controlled the body equally, and thus the coordination of movement from the copperhead head was fairly poor. It has two tracheas, two esophaguses, but the lungs are shared in common. There may only be one heart with such an animal, but it's possible there can be two. Furthermore, thankfully in this case, the two heads are far too close to each other to be able to fight. But imagine if they had longer individual necks. If one head died fighting for control, then the second would also be doomed. Two-headed snakes are actually more common than you might think. For example, one Chinese farmer from the city of Shenzhou found one on his land. He managed to catch the snake, photographed it, and showed it to his friends, but didn't hand it over to biologists. Eventually, the reptile successfully escaped from the glass tank it was being held in, knocking it over. He didn't see it ever again, but it was later revealed that the snake had been either a python or a boa constrictor. Not a poisonous snake, but one that strangles and swallows its prey. I wonder how its heads would divide its prey. Snakes with multiple heads are scary, right? But not as scary as giant insects. Every now and then, there are photos of grasshoppers and locusts that are the size of a man's hand, or even larger. Recently, in New Zealand, a unique species of grasshopper was discovered, the Weta. They are an incredible size, growing up to 7 inches long, 18 centimeters, larger than the average man's palm. They're heavy too, weighing three times more than a mouse. They might grow to be as big as cats. Whilst insects don't have skeletons, they do have a hard outer shell which prevents them from growing too large. In addition, they have a very different respiratory system, and if they were to grow too large, there may simply not be enough oxygen in the atmosphere to support such monsters. But what if one day, colossal grasshoppers appear out of the fields and go on to conquer Earth? Uh, better not think too hard on what kind of apocalypse that would be. Unique specimens with an unusual structure are not the only frightening creatures on this list. For example, your favorite cats may surprise everybody. Don't worry, there are no anomalies that can ruin these cute furry creatures for you. On the contrary, sometimes they give birth to cats so special that they only garner more admiration and attention. How? Because they have wings. There are lots of recorded cases of winged cats, so we're sure that this entry is not a fake, and not a single unique mutation either. The nature of this phenomenon is still not exactly understood, however. A healthy cat or a cat with four paws on its back from birth has a couple of symmetrical developments, but sometimes the wings are developed enough for the cat to move them. Unfortunately, these winged cats cannot fly. Their bodies aren't adapted for it, and the wings themselves are too small. In addition, the wings are covered not in feathers, but in a soft fluff or light fur. 
Who knows, maybe one day a kitten with long wings will be born. What do you think? But believe it or not, a pair of wings is not the most impressive anomaly of an animal. How about an animal with an extra face? It was with this mutation that a pig was born in 2001 in the Chinese province of Jilin. It had one massive head, two large ears, two separate snouts, and two full mouths with an entire set of teeth in each. Apparently, the second pair of features came from an underdeveloped twin brother. Presently, no one knows for sure why such an abnormality developed. Some scientists reckon that two embryos may have collided in the womb and their tissues may have merged in a strange way. Perhaps this is exactly what happened with our amazing piglet with two mouths and snouts. After birth, the piggy couldn't suckle milk because of the shape of its jaws, but its owner, named Bai Zhu Jin, nursed the animal and it survived. Even more than that, the piggy eats for two, so it's likely it'll grow to be a giant. Dogs aren't far behind either with regard to unusual anomalies. True, their mutations aren't quite so perplexing, but they look impressive. For example, how about a dog with the muscles of a bodybuilder? I call this mutation double muscle. It's a very rare genetic abnormality in which the animal doesn't secrete a special substance that inhibits muscle growth. The result? One very pumped up pup. It's curious that this abnormality can only be found in one breed of dog, Whippet, but it is impressive, right? Animals that have such specific muscles are incredibly strong. A dog like this may well overpower a small bear. But metabolic disorders can be dangerous and harmful to the animal, however, and it seems like such a superpower has its price. Uh, by the way, double muscle can also be found in both cattle and humans. A weird connection, right? Okay, so we know super strength exists in the animal kingdom, but what about super speed? How could an animal acquire such superpowers? Perhaps they have more limbs than the rest of us. Well, such a unique mutation exists. In Croatia, on the farm of Zorin Paparic, three kids were born to an ordinary goat. Two of them were healthy and perfectly ordinary, but the third? Well, the third was unique. This goat was born with eight legs, two pairs at the front, two pairs at the rear. In this case, the extra legs do not function, but remain nevertheless. As we've already mentioned, usually an additional set of limbs is associated with fused Siamese twins, but this is not the case. No fused twins here. Scientists examined the kid and discovered that he really has eight legs of his own. Biologists believe that this was a result of the fact that the cub's parents were close relatives. True, his health isn't good and he'll likely begin walking later than other goats, but in all other aspects, everything's fine with him. Perhaps when this goat begins to develop his speed, he'll be as fast as a race car. But what would you say if you learned about the additional extremities of an animal that shouldn't have them at all? It seems that one snake decided that moving on her stomach was too uncomfortable, so she grew a leg. A snake with one developed clawed paw was found in southwestern China in 2009. Moreover, it wasn't a hatchling, but an adult snake. The most frightening thing about this entry is how they found her. A Chinese woman, Din Shangxiu, went to look out the window on an ordinary day and saw a monster hanging down. How would you react if you suddenly met a snake with a clawed paw? Would you run away, crying out for the police or animal control? Din was as cool as Lara Croft. As fast as lightning, she reacted by grabbing her shoe and smashing the snake with it. She knew nobody would believe her story, so she snuffed out the snake, leaving evidence of the existence of such a unique animal. One only born and estimated once in a thousand years. The claw probably helped the snake to climb up, helping it no doubt grow to an incredible size. But sometimes such deviations can become a big problem. Often, animals with abnormalities and mutations simply cannot survive without human help. This is exactly what happened in the south of Russia, where a lamb was born with a human face. This anomaly looks amazing. The head of this animal is a human-esque face with black eyes which look like an evil mask, a hooked nose, and a sharp chin resembling Gargamel from the Smurfs. Don't you think? It even looks like it's angry. Of course, the lamb's face only resembles a human face due to a dangerous mutation. The bones of its upper jaw and nose are not developed, and this is believed to be due to maternal malnutrition. This lamb couldn't eat on its own, so its owners had to manually feed it. 
Luckily, it behaves no differently to the other goats. So don't worry, this goat is not a monster. Unlike the so-called giant hogs, these are giant wild boars that are increasingly found in the forests of North America. Once in Alabama, a father and son went hunting and encountered such a beast who was digging the ground for worms. The beast was absurdly huge and aggressive, with its dimensions meaning incredible strength. Had the pair hesitated, this enormous boar would have simply crushed them. But thankfully, neither the hunter nor his son was hurt. Not only that, they managed to shoot the giant hog. The boar turned out to be a true champion of his species, at nearly 11 and a half feet in length and weighing half a ton. That's the weight of two regular giant hogs, or as much as a grown bear. According to scientists, the reason for this incredible growth was a genetic mutation. In the forest, such a beast is the unambiguous king of the animals, because its huge weight gives it tremendous strength, whilst its natural aggressiveness makes it absolutely fearless. It's scary to think about walking in the woods now that you know monsters such as this exist there, right? Now get ready for a shock, because our next animal would terrify even the bravest of hunters. This was a unique case of mutation causing its subject to be called a buffalo gator. In Thailand, in 2015, a calf was born in a remote village covered with sturdy scales instead of skin. The structure of its skin is amazing, because instead of the usual characteristic skin for a calf, it was strong and scaly, like an alligator. Moreover, the shape of its head also resembled a chimera, a long mouth, a flat skull shape, half calf, half crocodile. But since the animal didn't survive, we'll never know whether it would feed on grass or become an armored predator with powerful bull-like legs. The villagers actually considered the birth of such a monster as a good omen. How would you react if you saw a creature like this? Tell us in the comments below. And if you're one of those people who only like one video out of a thousand, you have the opportunity to like ours now. After all, the time has come for you to press the button and subscribe to our channel for more awesome content.